The last 36 hours were filled with a whole load of new experiences that expanded and transformed my mind and my whole self. First, I let my pride step away and reached out for help, which wasn't an easy process at all. In the last weeks of suffering in this hospital bed, I have asked, whatever you want to call it, God, the universe, the great spirit, for guidance, help, and healing, led by my strong desire to continue living my dream, which I felt had only started, which I only got a glimpse of. But not only was it about living a dream, as in traveling, writing, or any of these things that I'd rather call hobbies than dreams. It is about being absolutely in tune with myself, with what feels right for me and my life, without the expectations of family, friends, and society. This quest is about healing, healing for me and I wish also for others. It is about growth and what's my real purpose in life. Well, riding a bike isn't something I would call my purpose, maybe if I would do it more professional. But everything that the motocross seems to bring with it is what I want to dive in deeper. Solitude which I believe is the path to connect and integrate with your true self and expand from that space. Freedom, based on an absolute minimalized life in only four bags and with a motorcycle as home, best friend, mentor, teacher and only form of transport that hasn't been very reliable. Learning through physical and cultural challenges that I'm facing Gaining wisdom that cannot be found in books but on the road. Living a life in simplicity and humbleness as taught to me by the wonderful locals of Indonesia. Practicing gratitude in daily prayers and meditation. Gaining more faith for life, trust that everything will unfold itself just perfect without being able to plan it, without knowing where we'll sleep next night or knowing if I will still have enough money for food and fuel in a week's time and inspiration. Being inspired by the places I traveled, by nature, by different religion and traditions, by the people I meet or observe, and the desire and call of being an inspiration and mentor for others. Reading, feeling and experiencing how much I already seem to be exactly that for so many people around the world has left me in emotions that I can't find any suitable description for. Yes, the money is something that was urgently needed and I asked and wondered a lot why life puts me in such a desperate situation right now when things just finally started to roll smoothly. I didn't think I would find the answer to that question so fast. Reaching out for help and witnessing this incredible wave of healing energy, kindness, of support, love, generosity buzzing all around the world to get me out of this situation is something that has extended all my old belief systems, all these self-set boundaries and my faith in humanity and in what's really possible. I have always believed one of our most important duties as human is to help where it's needed and reach out to people that are weaker and can benefit from our existence. Not only once has this attitude left me heartbroken, disappointed or misunderstood. Only over the last year I have learned that pure service isn't something we give in return for being loved. It is a karmic action that eventually will be returned. Well, I must have done a few things right in my life to receive the support that has been given to me in the last couple of days. I clicked through a few hundred donations and after only a few I stopped looking at the numbers in the PayPal receipts. It didn't matter if it is a dollar, ten or one hundred dollars. I was praying for a little bit of magic in my life and this is exactly what you have transferred into my account. Every word, every wish, every blessing and every name that appeared on the screen are pure energy that leaves me in tears of gratitude, floods my heart with love and illuminated my body with the most amazing healing energy. The goal of paying my hospital bill has been reached.
you made it possible to get me out of this situation and I have absolutely no words no words for what has been generated for me and it only took two days to get me out of this situation and I'm, I'm so touched and overwhelmed by your support and by your love and on Monday we'll all make all arrangements to settle that payment and to set myself free from that pressure. There's so much more I want to say but thank you as a word it doesn't really do justice to what I really feel and damn <laughs> thank you thank you so so much for your support for your love more than six thousand dollars have come through to my PayPal account yesterday afternoon I decided to just close my computer log out my phone and just leave it with the universe. I fell asleep at 5 p.m. and I slept until 9 a.m. this morning. When I opened my computer, read my emails, checked my PayPal and logged into my Instagram and Facebook, I couldn't believe what I saw. I couldn't believe that it didn't even take two days for this huge amount to be donated. And everything else that's coming through extra and already has come through additionally to that will go towards the motor quest and the massive change that I'm facing at the moment due to the fact that I will have to leave the tropical countries and replan my whole quest. I will have to look into a new motorcycle and start again from the scratch. So every single cent is so well needed and so highly appreciated and thank you thank you thank you vielen vielen dank you you're just amazing you're absolutely amazing <laughs>